If you want to learn how to make money with ChatGPT while sleeping, then in this video, you'll discover exactly how you can use ChatGPT to make money passively. And all you have to do is work once and you will be paid forever. But before we begin, please like and subscribe to this channel to receive daily updates on new ways to make money online. So, have you ever heard of the website Udemy? Udemy is a website where you can purchase courses and learn nearly anything. However, the most popular courses on Udemy.com are programming courses. Have you ever thought about how much money people make passively by selling courses on Udemy? Let's take a guess and comment below. So, Udemy.com itself will show us how much money this seller earns on a monthly basis. If I look for JavaScript, which is a programming language, then it will display all of the best-selling JavaScript courses, and the fact that all of these courses have hundreds of thousands of ratings indicates that they are extremely popular on Udemy.com. What do you think these sellers make each month in selling JavaScript courses? So, make a guess, and let's see what happens. The top monthly revenue for JavaScript courses is $37,878. This is taken from the Udemy statistics page. I'll provide a link to this webpage in my video description so you can check it out. If we're looking for another programming course, Python. Python programming language is one of the most popular programming languages. As you can see, nearly all of these courses have over 100,000 reviews. So, what are your personal opinions? What is their monthly income? As you can see, the top monthly revenue is $113,926. Just imagine, if you start making this amount of money per month passively, then what will happen? And this is full live data, not a screenshot. Let's look for another course, Node.js, which is a server-side programming language that is open-source and cross-platform. And these are the top-earning Node.js courses. As you can see, simply by selling the Node.js course, these sellers earn roughly $11,000 per month in total passive income. You might think that, just because these are all the most popular and tough languages, these sellers are making so much money. So, if I search for one of the easiest languages, HTML5, so, rather than being a simple language, this course has over 88,000 reviews. And all of these courses have a significant amount of reviews. So, how much do you think they make? As you can see, they are passively earning $10,483 each month by selling HTML5 courses. So, if you create the same courses using ChatGPT, you might be able to earn money every month like this as well. If I search for another simple language, CSS, then you'll see that many people made CSS courses, and these courses are selling thousands of times. And if you look at their top monthly revenue, they are making more than $20,000 each month. And today I'll teach you how to use ChatGPT to create a similar programming course and earn actual passive income while sleeping. Just keep watching till the end to learn almost everything needed to create a programming course using ChatGPT. But before that, we need to understand why coding-related courses sell more on Udemy.com. Udemy mentioned in its official blog post that coding is a highly sought-after skill that's why people want to learn code or improve their coding skill. That's why they most likely buy coding courses from Udemy.com. Not only that, since Udemy courses are more affordable than coding boot camps and degree programs, that's why they prefer learning coding from Udemy.com. And the third reason is that, most of us have a busy schedule and since Udemy.com is user-friendly and allows the user to learn at their own pace, that's why they prefer Udemy to learn to code. So, you might understand, why coding or programming-related courses are so popular on Udemy.com and why should we sell coding courses? So for creating a coding course, the first step is to choose a topic or programming language for your online course. It's actually fairly simple, simply use Udemy to pick your first online course topic. Look, when you go to Udemy, and when you go to that category, they have all these different categories. Go to the development category from here, and Udemy will show you a number of subcategories as well as its programming language. You may create an online course in any language. However, first, you should create a course on a simple programming language or topic. For example, you can create an online course for web design. But before creating a course on any topic, use Udemy's official tool, where you can look for that particular course. So, in this case, it's web design. Now, Udemy will display all of the relevant data for the web design course. For example, the top monthly revenue for a web design course is just $7,329, which is not a good monthly revenue. It will also provide the search volume percentile across topics, as well as the search volume trend, from which you may determine how trending this course is. Then you'll see the top search terms for web design and other topics of interest to your audience. Here, people are also interested in CSS courses. 
However, the conversion rate is the most important factor in this case. The greater this rate, the better the course on that topic will be. Then Udemy will show you some top earring courses. You may also look at these top earning courses to discover how they create their courses and what topics they cover. This will give you an idea of what you should and should not include in your course. However, because CSS includes coding, I would like to create a course on it. Furthermore, the top monthly income is high at $20,469. I suggest you should create a course with a top monthly revenue of $10,000 to $20,000 and a conversion rate of greater than 5%. So we've found our topic. Now, in the second step, we'll discover how to make money by creating a programming course using ChatGPT. So, the first thing we want to do is ask ChatGPT to assist us in creating an outline. For this, use this prompt, write a detailed outline for an online course, then add the topic name. For instance, I include CSS. So, whatever your topic is, simply alter it in search. And just notice, ChatGPT start writing a full overview for our online course CSS. This tool is insane. The first is titled Introduction to CSS, followed by Selectors and Properties, and so on. As you can see, we have a complete outline for our CSS course. So, if I go back to Udemy and open one of these courses, I'll discover the course content section at the bottom of the page, where they provide all of the course outlines. Like them, ChatGPT also provides us with a detailed outline for our CSS course. We must now use ChatGPT to create each course lesson in detail. Simply use this prompt to write a complete script for a lesson, then add the lesson name. Copy the lesson from the outline, paste it over here, and ask them to explain everything. As you can see, ChatGPT will start writing a whole script on the topic of what CSS is. Not only that, but it also includes a coding snippet with an explanation that describes what that code does. You may have realized that you do not need any coding skills to create a coding course for Udemy. ChatGPT will do all of the tasks for us. As you can see, it mentions that you need to include a link to a CSS file in the head of your HTML document. Here's an example of how to include a CSS file. Then it adds all of the coding samples needed to understand what CSS is and explains them one by one. Now you may have noticed that many courses on Udemy are taught using PowerPoint or Google Slides. You may also create the course for Udemy using Microsoft PowerPoint or Google Slides. Simply choose a template from Google Slides and then copy and paste the scripts from ChatGPT. As you can see, the first slide is nearly finished. Similarly, you must copy and paste everything from ChatGPT and make slides one at a time. Now to copy the coding snippets, all you need to do is install this awesome screenshot Google Chrome extension and then it will be added as an extension. Simply go back to ChatGPT, click on the extension, click on the selected area and capture a screenshot of that coding snippet. Then just save the snippet to your PC. To add the code snippet, go to Google Slides, click Insert, and then choose the downloaded picture from your PC. And it will be included in our Google Slides presentation. When you've finished modifying all of the slides, all you have to do is click on the slideshow and then read and explain a little bit about what's on each slide one by one. You may also hire a voiceover artist from FiverrR.com if you are unable to voiceover all of the slides. Now, for recording slideshows, you may use OBS Studio to record the slides and voiceover, which is absolutely free and will be supported on all platforms. So, that's all for now. If you like the video and want to make even more money with ChatGPT, then watch the video that appears on the screen. And don't forget to smash that subscribe and notification icon to discover new make money online ideas daily. Thanks for watching.